My name is Tripp and I'm the host of Animal Trails. On the show we take a fun look at some of the animals we have right here in Palm Beach County. So hold on to your seats as we go on the trail. We have a special treat for you today. We're going to take you on a horseback patrol with the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. In the Old West, Sheriff's officers depended on horses to patrol a large territory and to protect its citizens from bandits. Today, officers are still helping to combat crime and to make the community a safer place to live. We're here today in beautiful Lake Worth, so let's go on patrol. Joining us today is Sergeant John Howley and Deputy Sheriff Brandy Tenlin. Also joining us are Lance and Mooney. What do you enjoy about working with these horses? Just the challenge every day. They're learning their personalities and seeing how smart they are and they're always trying to test you and it's a real challenge working with them. For me it's the connection, you know, it's a connection with the sentient being. Um, you know, riding a horse, uh, for one it's nostalgic, isn't it? and uh, the connection with the community. When you're patrolling on horseback, you're close to people, people have an opportunity to come talk to you. And uh, you know, the dialogue's the most important thing, really, for uh, proactive patrol, which is what we're, which is our purpose down here in the city of Lake Worth and other districts we've served. What are some of the reactions that you receive from the residents as you're riding through the neighborhoods? Probably the best part going into a new area like Lake Worth that we haven't been and seeing the reactions of people who are not used to seeing horses on the road. They're shock and awe and letting the kids see the horses that probably wouldn't be able to get to see a horse up close. These horses are so beautiful. Uh, what kind of training is involved uh, for these horses before they go out on the streets? When we get them in, they're all different. So they've all got different experiences when they come in. So we try to we try to set up different scenarios in our facility, controlled environment, things that they might experience out on the road, and then. Uh, once we're comfortable with them, then we start taking them out into a quiet area. Uh, Mooney's been around with us for five years, Lance about a year and a half, so I wouldn't take a brand new horse uh, in the downtown area right off the bat. So these sort of, it's like building blocks where they build up to different things they can do. We're near the steps of, of Lake Worth City Hall and we're gonna give Lance and Mooney their favorite treat, peppermints. Now, how did you find out that peppermints were their favorite treats? Actually, it all started with Mooney. His owner, when he donated, when he donated Mooney to us, that was the deal breaker. He had to, we had to indulge him in the Starlight Mints. Now, I'm not sure if it's the magic elixir of corn syrup and red dye number five, or. Wow, they uh, they they lick your hand a little bit when they take yeah. the. Yeah. Mooney's got better manners. He's a little older. But they do like them, and they're, they're easy, easy treats to keep on hand. Always have them in our pockets, so it's the least we could do. It's, uh, it's a hot day, and they work hard carrying us around town. So. If you'd like to learn more about youth programs that work with horses, such as the Eagle Academy, or already have a horse and would like to volunteer for the Mounted Citizens on Patrol, please contact the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. The next time that you're in Lake Worth or throughout Palm Beach County, you may see these magnificent horses helping to keep your neighborhood safe. So thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time on the trail.